Saw you walking by today With the sunset in your eyes I couldn't find the strength to say What was running through my mind You couldn't help but notice me Staring with that awkward smile From the other side of Thompson Street Where do I begin? When I met you, I had no idea what true love was. I thought I had an idea, maybe thought I've experienced it in my life, but wow, was I wrong. Not often you'll hear me say that. <laughs> but over the past 11 years, you have shown me what love really is. Passion is another great quality you have. You love your vehicles, talking about them, looking at them, watching, watching videos of them taking photos of them, cleaning them. I think that covers it. All I can offer is my best Through the good and bad, through rich and poor Oh, you look beautiful A few more qualities I love about you. You're caring, sensitive, kind, honest, loving, motivated, and most of all, selfless to me and the boys. shown us so much love and generosity in 11 years. When we started dating, it didn't scare you away one bit that I had two of the cutest 18-month-old twin boys. I love you so much, Shave. You know me better than anyone. You know what mood I'm in just by the tone of my voice or a look in my eyes. So here is my promise to you. I promise to never go to bed mad. Always kiss you goodnight and kiss you before you leave for work in the morning. I promise to work on always being right. I promise to support your dreams and your drive. I promise to be honest and faithful. I promise to be adventurous, spontaneous, and go with the flow. I promise to lift you when you need it. I promise to hold our family up high when times are low. I promise to put us first, and most of all, I promise to love you all the days of my life. You are the love of my life. That's all I got. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> you have given me so much joy, love, happiness, friendship, confidence, and many gray hairs. I choose you. I vow to love you unconditionally and always be by your side. I vow to encourage you in trying times, to comfort you in times of sorrow, and be merry during the times of celebration. I vow to always have a bag of Doritos ready and never leave your glass empty. Remember when I tell you I love you. It's not out of habit or it's not to start conversation. I say it to remind you that you're the best thing that's ever happened to me. And lastly, as Beth Dutton would say, the only thing I ask is that you outlive me, so I never have to live another day without you. Aww. Lindsay and Dave, you have expressed your love to one another through the commitment and the promises you have just made. That your lives are meant to be shared as one, that you are stronger together than you are apart, and that for all your days yet to come, you wish to share all life's joys and challenges committed to one another. 
It is with that in mind that I pronounce you husband and wife. <laughs> you may kiss your bride. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Moore. Mr. and Mrs. Moore. I also want to officially welcome Dave and his family. He has been stringing us along for a while, so it's, <laughs> it's kind of nice to see the commitment. Thanks, Dave. <laughs> now let's make a toast for, to a very long and prosperous marriage for Lindsay and Dave. forget when you taught me how to build a car and how to put up Christmas lights on top of the house. Dave, you have walked us through this path of our young childhood and raising us into young men. Thanks, thanks for the good memories that you have taught us upon, have brought us, brought upon us. Congrats, congrats. I love you guys. Enjoy the good and grateful wedding. My name is Dylan. I'm Lindsay and Dave's son, as you all know me, obviously. And mom, on the other hand, she is very nice to me and shows me how to be a better school, how to be better in school, and helps me with my assignments. And she wants me to be a gentleman also. She's been there since day one and is very beautiful, and this is why all my friends call her a MILF. <laughs> Some advice for you, Dave. I want you to always remember to tell her these three little words. You are right. <laughs> I wish you both all the happiness in the world, and I cannot wait to watch your love continue to grow. So everyone, please raise up your glass, and let's toast to the beautiful bride and this handsome groom. <laughs> Cheers. Most importantly, Lindsay, thank you for making Dave the happiest person in this room. I cannot wait to watch these two grow with each other. We are all here today to celebrate Dave and Lindsay, wishing you nothing but the best in lifetime of love and happiness. To Dave and Lindsay. Yeah.